Good morning guys, welcome to the work week vlog. I just got a Starbucks bacon good sandwich because AJ and I didn't go grocery shopping this weekend as per usual and I have a gift card. So yay, happy Monday. I got my Stanley cup and we are ready to have a good week. Oh my gosh, I really, really need gas. I'm gonna go get gas and then go to work. I just got home from work. I got home at four today, which is super fun. I'm in a good mood because of that. So I'm gonna edit a video for an hour and then we're gonna work out. Let me see what Vinny's doing. Oh my gosh, of course you're here. Of course you're here. Okay, AJ texted me while I was at work saying that he finished the pergola. Dun, 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 dun. Guys, oh my goodness, it looks so good and professional. I am obsessed. So obviously we need to stain it, but you guys were saying, and I looked online, that I have to wait for the wood to dry first. Apparently you have to wait like a few months for the wood to completely dry out because it's pressure treated wood. So we're obviously gonna stain it the same color as the floorboards, which is like a dark walnut. It's gonna look so good. I'm so happy. It's, uh, I'm so proud of him. Guys, aren't you proud of him for doing this? Morning, you guys it's Tuesday I just got back from my dad's I was there from 7 30 this morning to 9 and now it's 9 15 and I'm back at my mom's I just had to do some stuff that was urgent and that was due today over there so yeah let's go inside let's have a good day I just ate my bagel on the way over here okay we, it's like one o'clock we're starving so we're ordering chilies appetizers <laughs> <laughs> it's not taking my credit card <laughs> What is up with that? We've come to this low point. Yes, hold on. Did you put your card number in? He doesn't want to take it. Look, I'm doing it like this. Ugh. <sighs> you want to edit this one? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was rough. It was rough. The unedited one. Yeah. It makes you really appreciate the well-edited uh, video. She didn't rough. like the unedited vlog. It was rough. I watched it last night and I was like... <sighs> And it's a long one too. Yeah. Thank but you. now you see how much work goes into it. Yeah, the transition, the music, nice mm -hmm. and cute makes it artistic as opposed mm -hmm. to welcome to life, which many times is boring. Vinny, I'm home. Vinny, you're such a big girl. Say hello. Mwah. Love you. Okay. What's up guys? I feel like I haven't actually talked that much in this vlog yet. Oh my gosh. Department of the Treasury. Guys, did I tell you I have jury duty in June? This is my second time on jury duty. They love me over there. Stop. A thousand dollars? Stop. Tax refund. What? Vinny, we got money back. This doesn't make any sense because we owed a lot of money on our taxes. Why are they sending me money? I'm not gonna question it, but maybe I should question it. Hold on, I just got the craziest message. <laughs> it's 3.52, I don't really know what to do. AJ's at the gym. I feel like I'm all over the place with this new schedule because sometimes I get off early, sometimes I don't. So I don't know, like should I work out? Should I just chill? I don't really have anything to edit, so I don't know, I'm like, I need to do something, you know? Comment down below, what do you guys do after work? Do you do nothing? Do you work out? Do you fold laundry? Oh my gosh, don't remind me, I have laundry to do. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll go back to my one meaningful task per day remember that from the old times maybe i will do laundry as my meaningful task today or maybe something else who knows only god knows oh ag just texted me saying that he thinks i should go to the gym but i don't like to go by myself should i <laughs>
What do you think? Sturdy? Watch out for the nails down here. Huh? Sturdy? <laughs> you get the pull ups off of it? You could. Okay guys, I just put my new sheets on the bed and I'm so freaking excited because I've been dying to work with Brooke Lennon like since I started my channel and I finally have the opportunity to work with them in this video. So thank you Brooke Lennon for sponsoring today. These are the softest, most luxurious and affordable sheets you will find on the market, you guys. I have no words, okay? Absolutely no words. I knew they were hyped up, but I didn't know they were this soft. So I'm obsessed. So Brooke Lennon's mission is to provide you and me with beautiful sheets without the luxury markup. Guys, they have more than 100,000 five-star reviews and I'm going to be the 100,001 person because I cannot say enough good things. Especially with wedding season coming up, it's the summer, people are getting married and it's just the perfect wedding gift for that special couple in your life. When I got married, I wish I knew about Brooklyn and back then because I would have 100% put them on my registry. They have sheet and towel bundles that make the perfect gift for any couple. So this is the Lux Hardcore Sheet Bundle, which includes a core sheet, extra pillowcases, and a duvet cover. If you want to save money, go ahead and buy the bundle because you'll save 25%. Okay, so I chose the white color of the Lux Sateen Sheets. Guys, they have a 480 thread count and they literally feel buttery smooth and they almost have like a luminescent like radiance to them. It's hard to explain unless you've experienced it, but oh, it's so soft. You can choose to mix and match from 20 plus colors and patterns to fit your particular style. And the best part is you can shop for your Brooklyn and Lux Hardcore bundles from the comfort of your own home. So Brooklyn is offering you guys a special discount of $20 off your order of $100 or more. So just click the link in the description and use my code RACHELVIN. Anna came over, we're gonna record a podcast. Oh. Did you listen to the podcast with him? Yeah, I listened to you like it right now. I did, and he said he liked it, so I might not have a job anymore too. Yep. The numbers are kind of showing that way, too. <laughs> you like my cup? I do, I saw that. It's nice because it can fit in the car. Mm -hmm. The bottom of the base or whatever. You're Just really tan. Guys, look how tan she is. Goals. Actually, no goals. Not goals. We're doing a skincare episode. Did I tell you? Hey, my skin, by the way, thank you very much. I take great care of it. That's me, true. So Your face is like get, awesome. Like, my body's just gonna get dark when it's lighter outside. What were you doing? Why are you so tan? This is literally just from daylight savings. Like, I do the same exact thing, it's just so near when I'm outside now. Okay. Whatever you say. Whatever. Whatever, loser. Sorry, just get Hi guys, so there's been a development. The receptionist that was supposed to start next Monday texted me during the middle of the podcast recording and told me that unfortunately it's not gonna work out because he found another job, a better job. So I'm in shock, but it's gonna be okay. Everything happens for a reason. If it wasn't a good fit, then I'd rather know now than like two weeks in, you know what I mean? Back to the drawing board. Tomorrow I'm going to open up the applications again or like the job posting and start looking for applications. But that just means that I'm going to be working at my mom's for longer than ex expected. That was that. It's never a dull moment. Never a dull moment over here. I just started reading this book, Mother's Day by Patricia McDonald. I'm about 20% of the way through and it's so good. Like I'm hooked. I'm hooked. So if you're looking for something to watch, <laughs> read. I recommend that book. It's a pretty easy read. Gosh, I can't believe you quit. Listen to that podcast episode. It's um, the Would You Rather episode. If you want to see my reaction like live. Crazy. Crazy. Life is crazy. And the thing is, this is so common. Like I'm not even affected by it because I'm like, yeah, this happens all the time. At my dad's, this happened all the time. Oh gosh. So yeah, I'm used to it. Whatever, who cares? I'll figure it out. Ow, I have heartburn. Ow. <laughs> I don't know if it's anxiety or stress or what. What was I saying? Oh yeah. <laughs> The book. I feel like I've been missing a good fiction book in my life and because I've just been reading self-help for the past month or so and so I'm really excited to have this book to read because it's just such a good way to close off the night and relax. So anyways, I will see you tomorrow. Okay, we're here at Panera Bread for lunch. I got a chicken Caesar salad and a chicken noodle soup. She got something like that. <laughs> I got chicken and 
and uh, something wild rice. Okay. okay, I just got back from work. We're gonna go to the gym. I changed. I feel like I always wear this outfit on leg day. These are just my Amazon biker shorts and this shirt from Marshalls. I was so hungry after work that I just ate like a full plate of cheese and crackers. We have this big block of Manchego cheese and we've been obsessed with this. So I just like shoved that down my throat. But let's go to the gym. It was a pretty good day. Um, I was able to catch up on a lot of like my data entry stuff that I do at the office and we posted the job for the new receptionist and we're going to be looking through resumes this next few days and hopefully we find someone good because everything that happens is meant to happen I feel like so let's go to the gym <laughs> Okay, I'm back from the gym. AJ's chopping vegetables, if you hear that. You know what, guys? One of you commented on one of my other videos when I was, like, showing you the shirt, and I was like, these are just a bunch of random dudes. And you guys were like, no, you idiot. Like, that's, like, a band or something. So, I apologize. Okay, so I just got this in the mail. It's from my work, from my dad's, and the HR person sent out a anniversary card and it says happy anniversary four years with the company may 2022 keep up the amazing work we're so proud to have you on the team isn't that so sweet that is so sweet it's little things like this that the hr person has implemented since we hired her like i don't know six months ago or so that just like make such a big difference sometimes it's the little things in life you know guys who's that who's coming in here unannounced with no permission What's cooking good looking? What's that? It's a, it's a goose, a goose. Did you bake it? Excuse me. You bake what? The fish? The no. fish? I haven't even started the fish. Oh. I don't even know what the fish is. Can I take this paper down? Sure. Thank you. Oh, by the way, AJ is not sticking to this anymore. That's so, <laughs> it is though. Remember how I was saying that he was trying to reduce his calories and then you saw us eat like that lettuce and chicken meal that lasts like a day? So now the alternative approach. So now the alternative approach is to just eat a more balanced diet, which I was an advocate for from the very beginning because that's not sustainable. Like eating chicken and lettuce and beans. <laughs> the beans, the beans were the best part, to be honest. Beans are so good. So yeah, that's what we're doing. Just a more balanced diet. Not that I was doing it with him anyway, but I kind of just do whatever. I think he's still doing a body recomp, right? But he's just doing it in a more balanced way. Cuddles. Why are you so mad? Oh, you just hit the camera. Oh my gosh, Vinny. Really. Yummy, yummy, yummy. This actually looks really good. Good job. Oh, wow. Look at this. We've got some chimichurri right here. Some fish. This is a hella fresh meal, by the way. It looks so good and so healthy. This is what I mean by like a more balanced diet. So it's still super healthy, but it's definitely has carbs, uh, fat from the oil and the fish and other stuff. So... So this is the meal from HelloFresh and what we do with meals that we love is we keep the card in case we want to make it on our own because they're not on the same menu like every week. Like the menu changes so it may be like a long time before this comes back on the menu so we just keep them in here in case we want to make them on our own. Little life hack. Good morning you guys, happy Thursday. On Thursdays we work 10 to 7, so I was able to have a slow morning. I made some eggs, had breakfast with AJ, which was actually pretty nice. So I'm gonna go to work, but I'm gonna bring this Folex carpet remover, stain remover, because in the waiting room at the office we have a rug and it has a few stains on it. So I wanna test this out and see if it works. So I'm gonna bring that. And then technically we're doing 10 to 7 today, but usually, I mean, the last time I was working a Thursday, which was once, I was able to come home at like 5.30 or 6. So it's really not that bad. It just depends on like if patients cancel, which is a whole other topic that I need to talk about because patient cancellation rate is so high. I am taking a quick nap because my head hurts a lot. We don't have patients right now. It's... 437 we have like five patients coming at five so i am resting before the final rush of the day my head hurts so bad it's not even funny aj just came to bring me some tylenol because we don't have any tylenol 
So that was nice of him and I'm just waiting for it to kick in. Okay guys, so this works really well actually. We had a spot on the carpet right here and all I did was spray this and I didn't like dab it or anything. I just sprayed a bunch of this and it's completely gone. I think we have one right here I can try. So I will see if that works in a little bit. Oh gosh, I look terrible. It is 6.51, I'm heading home. I'm so hungry, but like I think I'm in conservation mode to the point where like the hunger pains are gone. So um, I need to bring more snacks to work. That's always my problem. I never bring enough snacks. AJ ordered me a burrito from DoorDash. So I have that waiting for me. I'm so excited. And yeah, we had five patients show up um, for their appointments between five and seven. So, and that's a good amount for one doctor. So it was kind of like an end of day rush, but yeah, work day's over, going home. Good morning guys, happy Friday. You know what I just realized? It's kind of hard to tell the days apart for you guys because I just wear the same thing. My hair looks the same basically every day, but it's Friday, about to go to work. AJ just left to Gainesville. He's going golfing with his friends this weekend, but he'll be home tomorrow night. So I have the house to myself tonight. Let's see what we get up to. I have an exciting package to unbox when we get back from work. Vinny threw up in her room, so I just cleaned that up. Fun. Okay, it's lunchtime. Me and my mom are walking over to a restaurant to Imagine eat. Imagine that. I know. It's I was a like, beautiful day. I was like, let's drive there. And she's like, no, let's walk. It's right across the street. So the street. we're being crazy. Yes. Wear your sunscreen. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so I'm back from lunch and what I'm gonna do this afternoon is call three patients insurances because we're gonna do Mo's surgery next Friday on three patients and so I need to make sure that it's covered because it's like a big, it's when she removes the skin cancer and it's like a big surgery. So I need to call their insurances and make sure like everything's straight straightened away. We don't want any surprises. Each phone call probably takes about 20 minutes. So I'm going to be doing that for about an hour. And in between that, I'm going to be like answering phones and whatnot. So that's my rest. That's the rest of the afternoon. And then we have some more patients coming in a little bit later. If you don't like throw up, don't look right now. Skip forward. Vinny just threw up right there. It looks like poop, but she just threw up and it's partially on the carpet. Awesome. So I'm gonna clean it up and I'm gonna use this Folex cleaner. She must have done this in the morning because it looks dry. Vinny, I do not need to come home to this. I really don't. So here's the yellowness. Now let's Ew. Oh my gosh, this thing works miracles. Ew! I just flung it out. Not cool, man. Okay, it's basically completely gone. There's just like a little bit of yellowness here, but I'll keep attacking that. But wow, this is awesome, guys. 10 out of 10. I got it on Amazon and I'll link it down below because I did not think it would work this well, but it's awesome. Okay, I just got this package from Caraway. They sent me their baking set, so it's like the coolest thing ever. This pan is huge and it comes in this little organizer. We have a smaller pan, we have a muffin tin, and then we have a baking dish. How cool is that? Wow, I cut myself. Ouch. I cut myself from here to here. That's a big paper cut. Holy crap. I'm so grateful. You guys know I have the pots and pans set down here. So now everything matches and I'm so happy. Oh, I just realized my hair. I do have a discount code. I will link it down below for the, uh, the pans and the pots. And now I have a complete set and I'm so happy. I also picked up some poster boards from CVS on my way home from work because because I'm doing a little project tomorrow. <clears throat> You're gonna have to subscribe if you wanna see it. So I just ordered a pizza from Papa John's because 
It's our night alone, gonna relax, probably chill, watch TV, read. It's gonna be a relaxing night, so. Okay, the pizza just came. I just got a cheese and I got this stuffed crust. Apparently they have stuffed crust now, so I think it's just like mozzarella. And I love their garlic sauce, so good. And I'm also gonna eat this with ranch. Good morning, happy Saturday. I'm eating my oatmeal. It's just oats, blueberries, and peanut butter, as usual. Looking crazy. Um, last night I just watched a bunch of YouTube videos until like eight o'clock. And then I read for about an hour and then I passed out. So really boring Friday night, but it just makes me realize how much I miss AJ, you know? Like even though it's one night, it's like, I don't know what to do without him. I don't know, it's weird. It's hard to explain. Is that codependency? Who knows, probably. Anyways, I'm getting a jump start on today. I have so much to do. I have an exciting, huge express clothing haul that I'm doing in the next video. So make sure you subscribe. I'm about to like get ready and film that, but yeah. So happy Saturday. I think I'm gonna end it here. Don't forget to subscribe. I also have an Instagram and a podcast. I'll link those down below. And don't forget to check out Brooklinen. Again, they're giving you guys a special discount of $20 off your order of $100 if you use my code RACHELVIN. So I'll see you guys in the next video and have a great day, week, month. Love you guys. Mwah.